boiling outside. You'll feel sick in that. Michael, get a move on. We're going outside. Just shows you can never tell, can you? Are you ready? I've been ready since seven. Michael, what are you doing? Christ almighty! Give me Get in there. Mum, what have I told you about leaving your lighters lying around? Oh, that's right. Blame me. I'll be dead soon. You can blame me for that as well. We'll all be dead if he doesn't stop digging around with your lighters. Thanks, Mum. You're all right, love. Bloody hell, Michael, what have you done? Well, you said put plenty on. I know I did, but... Well, make sure you rub it in. Hey, go steady with that in the future. It's about three quid a bottle. Three quid a bottle? When was the last time you bought sun cream? Michael, you could have saved me a bit. Sorry. Here you go. Thanks, ma'am. There's eight of us, is that all right? <laughs> oh, it's the best kind of party. Welcome aboard. <laughs> Here you go, sweetheart. Whoa! 18 to 30, son. I am 18. Date of birth? 13th May 1972. I bet your maths teacher's a bit shit, isn't she? Oh, yeah. She's proper strict. She makes us do fractions. Hmm. Oh, ah. Uh... Sorry, son. How's it going? All right, go. I can't, can't really leave the girls on their own, so. Will you be all right here for four hours, or do you want to go back? Psst. Hey? Come, Ed. I'll get him on the boat, don't you worry. I've got a plan. I'm not sure. Michael. Oh. Oh. Michael. I, I forbid you. Michael. Well, be careful! something fishy. Oh, that might be me. Dead hot under here. Let's go and have a look. I'm gasping for a bevy. Come on, Benadorm! Let's get this party started! <laughs> Do you think we may have got on the wrong boat? Is this a party? Yeah. I think it's safe to say we got on the wrong boat. When do you go back? How many hours? Ah, dos. Oh, that's all right. We'll be back in a couple of hours. No. Dos días. Días. Two days? My mum's going to kill me. Is there no other way to get back to Benidorm? Oh, crap. Michael, row the boats ashore. Uh, I'm sorry, my little friend. We have no, how do you call it? Bandages. Did you hurt yourself bad? No, it's for this. <sighs> Dios mio. How old are you? 14. Have, have you got any headache tablets? My head's banging. Did you got the hangover? Where is your father? He's in prison. As the English say, no shit, Shylock. Get over here, now! Not you! I was just asking for some bandages to cover my tattoo. Don't make me come over there. Please don't make her come over here. All right, uh, I'll see you later. Adios, amigo. It was nice knowing you. Michael! I want to stay in the room. You, my lad, not leaving my sight. You should hobble him. Hobble him? What does that mean? Break his ankles, like in that film. Misery. He wouldn't get far then. I think this arrangement will do just fine for now. Thank you, Mother. We're on, Mikey. Keep walking. Scum. Leave it, Mother. I don't need a pee pack for you, Jamie. Where did your dad put the tanning pills? I don't think they're here. I think they've been chucked away. They must be in the grand's room. Have you got a key? Can't we just get some headache tablets and sell them? Headache tablets cost money, Mikey. 
As my old man says, it's all about profit margins. I oh, don't go in there. That's me and mum and dad's bedroom. You worried about what I might find? <laughs> hello, hello. What have we here? It's payday, Mikey boy. You little beauties. It don't work. Put them back. I Put them back. I need a new key. There is no problem. Yeah, there is a problem, because I don't want to have to funny about like that every time I want to shit. All right, son, what are you doing? I was just showing Tiger on the apartment. Uh, lovely place you got in, Mr G. Well, better than the crappy rooms we're in. Yeah, well, we're regulars. Michael, why didn't you open the door? You could hear us trying to get in. I didn't know it was you. I'll get you another key. Uh, yeah, four of them. Right, I think we'll go in the sun. All right, see you later. Catch you later, Mr G. Enjoy your shower. Are you part of the stag party? No, I always dress like this. Oh, right. OK, I'll knock on the door. I'm pretty sure the guy in here is the one who's getting married. Excuse so... me, excuse me. Yes, I'm part of the stag party. Can I help you? You said you weren't. It was a joke. How can I help you? We were wondering if you're in the market for some shit. Some shit? Yeah. What do you mean? Like, for the garden? A garden? Yes, like manure. Manure? What's that? French? Manure, no, it comes out of a horse's bottom. Look, man, we've got most things. We've got leapers, moggies, snappers, dust, dollies, eggs, jellies, dings and turkeys. Just let us know what you want. And if you've got the lettuce, we've got the candy. But we ain't got no manure. Hey, it's Pimp Diddy Martin! <laughs> See, you brought your bitches. They aren't my bitches. I think it's Bob a job week. Are you ready? Everybody's downstairs waiting. Drugs! He wants to know if you want to buy some drugs. Mikey, for God's sake, man. Wolves have ears. Drugs? You're selling drugs? How old are you? 12? I'm 16. And you? You should know better. If your father found out you were doing this, he'd bloody well skin you alive. So is that a no, then? Of course it's a no. Do we look like the kind of people who take drugs? Yeah. Yeah, you do. Martin, go downstairs, get the shots lined up. I'll be down in turn. Come in, boys. Oh, my God. I didn't see this. Wow. He's blind as well as stupid. Now, come on, boys. Don't be like that. Who exactly apologised? All three of them. My mum said sorry for being moody at the spa. My dad said sorry for having a go at you. My nana said sorry for being rude. It's about time. They also said if you want to go for a drink at the bar later, the first round's on them. It's all inclusive. I know. I think it was a joke. They definitely apologised. Yeah. Which one? All of them. The mum said sorry about the spa. The dad said sorry for having a go at you. And Tiger apologised for, well, letting me get a towel, even though it wasn't his fault. I don't believe it. Oh, well, that's up to you. But they did, they apologised. And the one I have a drink was at the bar. So where about you going then? I told you, I've got a bit of business. Yeah, I know you've said. What does that even mean? Ask no questions, I tell you no lies, mate. All right, whatever. Maybe see you in the morning or something. Yeah, sweet. I know what you did tonight. What did I do? You told your lot the same as you told my lot. And they both think each other apologised. So what? It worked, didn't it? Why did you do that? Because it's the right thing to do. And you always do the right thing. 
No, I don't, but when I do, it usually makes me feel better, especially if my family's involved. I'm friends. I thought you was going to sort out your bit of business. Mikey, I, um... I can't believe this. I completely forgot to tell you something. What? That girl Elena from the beach, she was looking for you. You're joking. When? Earlier tonight. I looked for you, but you weren't around, so I sent for her to meet you on the beach tonight at 9.30. It's 9.30 now. And the beach is, what, 90 seconds away? If I run. So run!